Welcome to this video tutorial from my yesterday. This video will go through the process of ordering products from the site, whether that is a storybook, a picture book, or a DVD. To begin, let's log in with the account that our funeral home has provided us. And if we've used the site previously, we may have been brought back to whatever section we were working on last. If that's the case, just go ahead and click the My Yesterday Builder menu link here at the top to return to the main menu. Now to order products, we're going to click on this step, Place Orders button at the bottom. However, if we want to order either picture books or storybooks, they must be in a published state. Uh, if you haven't done that already, uh, you can watch our YouTube videos on those two processes on our YouTube channel. Um, you may also wish to watch the Story Generator Media Library tutorials to gain uh, additional tips on creating your picture books and your storybooks. However, uh, we're going to assume that our books are published, so let's go ahead and hit place order. And we're brought to the order screen. We can see the three various products that we have available to us, portrait books, landscape books, and DVDs. The number of free items that we have left. So if our license included any uh, free items, we would see the quantities available to us here. And we can add any of the items to our shopping cart by clicking one of these links. So let's go ahead and add a portrait book. And the first thing I want to point out is this red warning. So here you can see I've created three storybooks in my system. However, this first storybook, just the, the name that I provided for this book, is not published. Hence, I get this, this red warning telling me I can't order it. However, if I go to my storybook demo, that one is in a published state and we see that error message went away. So let's go ahead and order five copies of that. If we wanted to, we could preview the book right from here. Uh, however, if we're happy with it, we're going to go ahead and hit add book. And it adds it to my order. And now we can see, since I had two free available to me, it's only going to charge me for the three additional, and my free items left quantity has dropped to zero. Let's go ahead and add a DVD. So DVDs allow us to add all the videos, uh, pictures, and electronic copies of the books, copies of the slideshows that we've created on my yesterday to a DVD that we can provide to friends and family. Uh, here I can go through all the various types of media and add them individually or if I just want everything included on the DVD I would just hit add all and we can see everything's listed over here as it was created or added to the DVD up here it's going to show me how much space I have left on my DVD so here you can see I barely used any in this demo uh, however we can it'll track and show you how much space you have available to you I can order a quantity of five of these is what I'm going to pick and I'm going to hit add DVD. Now this warning is just telling me that since I had such a little bit of information there's so much free space am I really sure I wish to do this? So by simply hitting add DVD I can say yes I do want it with that little bit of info. And we can see that that's been added to my order and since I had five free available to me the cost is going to be zero. Once I'm happy with it, let's go ahead and check out. And from here I can edit either the billing address or the shipping information that I have. I can change the quantities or remove an item. However, I can pick my shipping method. And once I'm happy with the order, I just hit place order. I go ahead and enter my credit card information. And once I'm happy with that, hit pay now. And I have successfully ordered my products. Now I can come back to this interface and see the status, whether that's ordered, shipped, or delivered, and view details of the order just by clicking this link. And once I'm done, I hit back just to return to my main menu. Thank you for your time. I hope this answered some questions for you. 
Uh, encourage you to watch our other tutorials on our YouTube channel, and best of luck with my yesterday.